in communities all across the state of Indiana, people are in need. Many of the members of our church have lost jobs. Without a doubt, there are hurting and struggling people. Foreclosure has been an incredibly huge issue. Oftentimes, individuals experience loss. Someone who is contributing financially to the household. And as a result, many times we drive by and we see vacant homes. We see homes where children once played and homes where the communities were once vibrant. We hear it on a daily basis that medical bills are a huge reason, second only, to loss of job in our community. We're a military community. One soldier who served both in Iraq and Afghanistan had wounds from those battles, came back, and found it very difficult to move forward. He was in risk of foreclosure. That We go to the sanctuary in our churches, and that's the place where we find comfort and peace and encouragement, but to the family, our home is our sanctuary. They're facing something they never thought they'd face. And we look at personally the families that are affected, and we realize that there's a family that lost their home, that lost their stability. Strong families make strong churches, and strong churches make strong communities. Whatever faith you're following, um, we're here for more than just us. We're here for a greater purpose. All of us, at some point in time, might find ourselves in a difficult situation. We have to be willing to go to those resources that are willing and able to help us. And sometimes it takes an incredible amount of strength to be able to stand up and say, I need help. We live in a community that has some resources to help those who are hurting. Asking for help is not giving up. It's taking charge of your circumstance. Indiana's hardest hit fund is a great resource. When families are facing hardships through maybe divorce, loss of a spouse, military service, no fault of their own, injuries or loss of employment, this is a resource for you. For those homeowners to no fault of their own that are struggling, that are in desperate need, there's up to $30,000 available to help them over a two year period. By logging on to the secure website or calling, homeowners can be connected with a counselor who will help them complete the application process. This is a really discreet and private way that they can find the assistance that they need uh, to, to make sure that they can take care of their mortgage needs. And uh, what I love about it is it's not just about them receiving something, but it gives them an opportunity to retain some pride and some self-worth and to realize that through this program, they can also give back and contribute to others. If you need help, contact Indiana's Hardest Hit Fund. Knock on the door and it will be answered. When the children are happy, when the home is together, we build those strong communities. And say, it's okay, there's help and there's hope for you. And uh, it's called the Hardest Hit Fund.